So, Daryl, we're into our final day here in Poland. What have your overall thoughts been on the trip? Oh, it's been an exceptional ship trip, to be honest with you. I've been, uh, been a lot of uh, pre-season tours and trips as a, as a player and as a manager. I think it's been up there as one of the better ones, really. Really been pleased with it. The hotel's been very accommodating. The, the resources have been great. So, we, yeah, delighted. And it was another day of intense training out there on, on, on the pitch. Just talk us through your thoughts on how the lads have been this week and, and the efforts that they've put in. Yeah, it's been tremendous. It's been obviously, like you've seen, you've seen it yourself. It's been a tough, tough week for them. But uh, they've got a good mixture of good fitness work. You know, brothers are doing an excellent job in their conditioning. Me, me S&C coach. And uh, they're looking fit and lean, which is which is good. And more pleasing for me, as so as we speak, and with a couple of weeks before the season starts, is that we haven't picked up any uh, any real serious injuries. And in a lot of the days, the lads have been out on the grass, been able to work hard, not missing too many days, because it's a vital period for a player to get as much of the pre-season program as you possibly can. And fortunately, so far, touch wood that uh, that's been the case. And from the intensity that they've shown out here in the warmer weather, you, you'll you be looking to, to carry that on into the coming weeks ahead of the season, which is going to be... Yeah, obviously, it mean, comes around quickly, doesn't it? It certainly does, yeah. The games come around quickly. It's a lot of games in League 2, uh, in, the, in the lower leagues of the English Pyramid, so we've got to be ready for that. The, 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 it's not about peaking too early as well. We've got to get peak through the course of the season. It's a long, long ten-month season, so we've got to make sure the conditioning of the boys is is absolutely spot on through that. And the players that aren't playing as regular football are getting topped up the right way with the fitness levels as well. So, uh, so they're not falling short for when they do get the opportunity. They need to take it.